What's up guys, it's the Fallen Clash here, and today it's going to be our, well, it was Return to 2000 Trophies, but um, I kind of changed that since right now I'm over 2000 by a lot. So, um, well this is pretty much, it's, it's a day after I recorded this actually. So, my st the what I have is kind of behind. Not really behind, but I mean, it's out of date, because I don't have nearly as much gold or elixir. Or elixir. Also, I found one of the best Dark Elixir raids I've ever seen. I got 3,000 um, Dark Elixir in one raid. It was amazing. So, um, up here, everyone is pretty much in the Crystal League for Division 1 Gold. And they're usually really hard to beat. Plus, it's really hard to get trophies. Like, I mean, you will often find people who give you like a lot for one star. But, uh, also I've been having slow connection recently, and I was going to record it differently, like, I mean, not record on, like, a different way, which is pretty cool in school. But, uh, I, my computer internet, like, so I'm able to do it. Maybe you just, you saw how much it's worth. Yeah, I, I, I was having the issues with, uh, with, I don't even know what it's called, um, but I think it fixed itself out. Like I said, I've been having really bad, uh, internet recently. So my reflector acts funny. And if you currently look at my base, you'll see I'm actually really high. But if you see me actually, if you see me like being like, if you see me in the middle of the night and I'm like leveled, it makes sense. Because I mean, everyone up here is like really good. Well, not really good. So I've seen some town hall sevens and I've three starred them with the barbarian archer strategy, which is kind of sad. But like up here, if you want to farm a dark elixir, I recommend coming up here. It's, there's actually a so a really good amount. Like, look at that, 890 right there, and that's a level two storage. That's not even. That's insane. Also, that's a really interesting design. I kind of like it. I mean, I would never use it, but I, I like that design. It's cool. And here's another tunnel seven. Like I said, I use, I will usually three star these people because I know what I'm doing. It, um, I, I've been searching for, uh, not search, uh, it takes, a, it really takes a while up here, because there's a lot of people with, like, dual expos. I've, I've actually seen at least 40 bases with maxed out expos. It's not even funny. It's 16 million to get both of those to level 8. And right there, that's an inactive base. If you go back and, like, pause it, you can see that the expo didn't have elixir. So, like, in that one before, there was elixir in it, but then the next one, or this one, you can see in the expo, there is elixir in it. So, it's really... It's a neat trick if you want to learn if, you're, if expos are filled or not. I do always have three lightnings as usual. One to take out Clan Castle if I feel like it. And the other to uh, take out like a mortar or something. Because taking out mortars is very important. Also, the reason why, uh, if you guys were wondering about the feature points thing, the reason why me and you do it is so we can get giveaways. So like, well, yeah, giveaways and to help ourselves. But usually giveaways. Like, if we have more subscribers and more of you guys helped us out, we could actually do like some giveaway sometimes but I mean currently I can't really do that also a, a strategy for destroying barbarian kings is just five barbarians and five archers it works almost every time if the, if the if your troops are out of range of like anything yeah me and he were talking about it if you look at us we, uh, I was past him in trophies and then he's just passed me right uh, now because I did lose an attack oh well I actually thought I was gonna lose this one too because those level six mortars actually destroy my troops. I place the wallbreakers at the top. Um, I assume they were smarter, but they're not. <laughs> uh, I did have a little bit of lag there. I started picking up buildings at the bottom, and I got the trophies there. And I also just placed uh, a couple lightnings. Yeah, see, like really bad lag. I'm so sorry about that. But uh, I did place a couple lightnings on the elixir to get the elixir because um, I'm really low in gold and elixir. Uh, we'll be right back with our next attack. So, okay, here's the next attack. I didn't, I actually cut out the searching for once, so you're welcome. <laughs> uh, there won't be a lot of attacks in this video because it takes a while to search, and half the time I'm not even near my computer, and the computer isn't on, or the internet's just really bad, and I don't feel like recording. But, um, anyway, so what you want to do at high trophies, I don't see why people put their uh, builder's huts in the corners because you want to protect as many buildings as possible 
So you don't want to have any freebies and stuff. This building had a lot, or this base had a lot of free buildings. Well, not really a lot of free buildings, but a couple. I think that was a level two or three dark barracks right there, which is pretty cool. I don't have one myself. I'm working on getting a, I'm working on getting a level two right now, because I want to get it up to gold. Because I heard those things are amazing. Plus, my king is getting is nearing max. I only have three more levels left, because it actually, as of now, has exactly one day left. You can tell that because how many uh, gems it takes. It takes 260 for one day. Um, two days, or I know three days is five, uh, 580 something, I think. I don't know. I'm not, I don't gem, so I don't really know. But, uh, that double wall breaker splash came in handy here as it knocked me through there. Through the, uh, double pink walls. Did I lose this raid? I feel like I lost this raid, but, oh, no, I didn't. I remember, I placed this lightning and I actually got really lucky and hit every troop. Oh, no, I didn't. I placed the second one. Yep, placed the second one there. It helped out a lot, because... There's only one thing splash left. Got the town hall. And if I got 50%, I'd be very happy. Uh, I did get give him a shield, but that's for two reasons. Gave him one for the for the 40% and for the town hall, so. But yeah. What you want to do when you have high trophies, you want to have enough resources to keep your to maintain yourself, but you don't have too much to be like a target. So this next video. I don't think I attacked in it. No, I didn't. I just showed you replays. So I have been attacked a couple times. I've been on a wing streak recently, which is pretty awesome. Sorry, I was just acting up. It's causing me not to talk or anything because I don't want to open my mouth. But there, the spring trap activated. And uh, threw also the giants. And uh, there... Oh, God. Uh, the archers in my clan castle, they came out, and the giants don't actually target clan castle troops. Because technically they don't register as them as a defense. I actually, what would they be registered at? I have actually have no clue what they would be called. But that person, they used their lightnings on my mortar and wizard tower. But, I mean, that didn't really do any work. Because, like, the wizard tower is just like, no. And it's destroying. Because I like how they don't glitch out anymore. Also, that Tesla right there. No, not that Tesla. The Tesla on the right side that you don't see in this video. Oh yeah, there. It's a uh, upgrade. It's actually level two right now, which is really cool. He just finished upgrading. So uh, I am. I'm working. On, you know, it, like most people be all like, "Why are you doing Teslas? They're pretty useless." But at level like four and five, they're actually really good and it's really awesome. So here, I actually thought the Archer King would do all the work. It's half the time. So an Archer King comes in, and I well actually I forgot if I won or lost this one. But half the time, an archer game would come in and just do like the dirty work and just destroy my base. And it's really annoying and I hate it. <laughs> so there, the splash damage finished them off. Pretty awesome. And like you see right there, 2,089 trophies. I actually went up to 2,098 and then I lost 18 just like 13 seconds ago. Not like 13, more like 5 minutes ago when I first started this recording. But whatever. So yeah, that's the Hidden Tesla level 2. Like I said, I moved it. To protect my gold and dark elixir that I don't have any of. I have more dark elixir than gold, actually. Not really, but I mean, that would, that would be really awesome. Like I said, I haven't seen, I, this is after I attacked that person with the amazing not dark elixir. I did that in my, uh, in my gym. Okay, right there. Unguarded, unguarded, uh, unprotected wall breakers. That was a really bad idea. Next is wizards. I mean, I, I'm fine with that, actually. I have nothing wrong with that. But the lightning spell right here. I hate this. This is the stupidest idea ever. Who put lightning spell? It takes two lightning to kill the king. And why you see on my the first place? Like a mortar tower. So that was just terrible. Then these pekkas go to the side and stuff. Then they get attracted by the uh, clan castle troops. But the clan castle troops are all like, you, you only target one thing. You're useless to us. Now, the wizards, they do do splash damage. And those are level five. So they wreck my troops. But, um, it's still, my troops are still strong enough to stop, hold them off. Like the Pekka, there are two of them, and they're both dead now. So, that's why you don't want to use, like, I mean, this guy, I don't even know what he was doing. I really don't know what this guy was doing. Um, this guy actually got, like, 25%, so I don't really know what happened. Oh, they're king and queen. Never do this. This is the dumbest idea ever. Second only to using pure archers. No, pure me. Hall, hall, using pure hall, hall riders, this is bad. But uh, anyway, the king and the queen... You don't want to have your king, like, why, sending out your king and queen last resort is a really bad idea because you don't want to have to wait for them to come back to life. It's really dumb. That's why I always use my king with my troops. But currently, I can't use my king because it's busy sleeping, healing, leveling up. 
So yeah, you see it over there. I like how the builder has a different animation for the king and queen. It's really cool. This is actually the first person attacking from the top. It's uh, a rare occurrence. But uh, so he has level six troops. I, you may have noticed a lot of level six troops come up here, and I, I, I'm afraid. But I mean, they haven't seemed to penetrate recently. So also, Pinkfowl, the guy who made this base, he's out of Town Hall Nine, and it's this really funny base that looks like a builder slut. So yeah, it's actually really funny. And sorry about that. My phone was. I I came home from school and I had like a thirty percent battery. I started recording and it got to ten. But uh, more clan council troops. I always make sure to have my clan council troops uh filled before I get off. So right now, I actually have twenty out of twenty five. So I'm just waiting until they get filled up. And there, the archer queen. Like I said, the archer queens will come in and do work on my base. It's not fair, and I, I hate I hate it because they have a um what archer queens have. These have a range of five, while archers have a range of four. So that means they can shoot from one block further away, which actually comes in handy. And then, uh, what's it called? Things like the, oh, the wizard can, has a range of three. I think dragons and minions also have a range of three. But I'm not entirely sure about that. So, uh, this, uh, I'm pretty sure this is pretty much over. But there's Hugh right there. But we're both in the Crystal League. The next, uh, league that I get is 2200, and that actually starts giving me Dark Blitzer. So he's been using the same army there. I did use a couple dragons, and matter of fact, I used to attack with four dragons, and that was so horrible that I decided not to use dragons again for a while. <laughs> because like the okay, so one dragon went for the town hall, while the rest. I'm gonna talk about this, not in this video later, but um, so this is the clan. The people with zero donations will get kicked, but uh, you guys can join. Still going for trophies. It's almost over. Uh, oh, I still have a minute left. Oh no, I don't. Well, anyway, the dragon store. So the dragons, um, basically, oh, what I'm excited about, yeah, the dark lights are the next thing. I already spoiled it. Hmm. Well then, um, so yeah, right, number twenty-four, my league probably got knocked down. I don't know, but uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys. I don't know, Wednesday, Thursday.